Okay, this thing will take us that way or that way. Looks like we might want to go both ways. That way. Which way looks like it's the remnant? The anomaly. I guess we have to have to go before we can find out. That way looks like it's where the anomaly is. Okay, anything over here? Nope. I like that there's two buttons to move to like leap while on on the slime. There's jump, which is jump off, and then there's R2, which is leap further onto the slime. Whereas in other games it would just be one button, jump, where the control stick or whatever would determine what you're would, whether you're jumping off or to another part of it. Okay. This one is where the last anomaly is. I'm gonna have to go to the other place. This is neat. No one will believe me when I tell them about this place. Oh, Ray. No one is alive to tell about this place. Let's see if I can get over there from here. Nope, I cannot dash. Where am I? I was totally just in a different place. Yeah, that's to get back to where I was. What about over here? Is there any reason to come over here? No! Don't fall in there. There definitely looks like there will be a side quest in this area. Oh, hey, look. A journal. I'll be damned if I'm going to sit here with that cursed thing gets closer and closer to our planet. Pertinax can cry mutiny all they want. It won't stop me from trying to get as many people off Cyclodoria as possible. A good captain always goes down with their ship, not with their planet, not when so many can be saved. Lucius Orbitus, pleasure craft captain, first class. Oh, so you're in charge of one of those, like, yachts for rich people. And you're like, oh, I'm going to save as many people as I can. By which you mean rich people who spent, gave you a lot of money. Ames is not going to like this. Ooh, I find another side quest thing. Whoa, what was that? Yep, good commentary. Collection of smoking carapaces. The rigid patterns of electrical current have been etched into the shells. Ugh. Simithoa squad, failed report. We have crashed into the remains of a capsized ship. Our generators were damaged in the crash, and we are running low on power. The crew and I are going to climb up these damaged cables to get a better survey of the area. That's a terrible idea. Climbing in the dark is a great way to get everyone killed. So I have sent Private Grimclaw to see if they can reactivate the ship's power drives. <sighs> I better break to the Ukelagon. Admiral, I think I've found something. Are they? They're... Uh, well... Pride. Ah, of course. Our journey has been a long one, and burnout is only natural. No, I mean literally. They seem to have gotten electrocuted by some of the broken ships here. I'm sorry, Ames. They're gone. That's truly unfortunate. 
We in the Maverick fleet sign up to be disposable, so others do not have to. It is never easy to be reminded of that. The Maverick fleet? <laughs> Did they say that before? Rest in peace, Simathoa squad. Alright, how much of the side quest do I have left? Okay, just three more. One more team. Right, one more team. Um, and then some more stuff, I don't know, maybe finishing up. I do not like this side quest. These people are idiots. It's a wonder their planet survived long enough to be consumed by the void. Where am I going? Over to... There, I guess. Ah, yeah, back here. I want to get this checkpoint. Of course. And here we are, over at a place where there's bound to be- So we just got a side quest thing. What else could there be? Maybe something else, so, like a, a thing we need to do in order to get the remnant? Do I want to even go down here? Looks like there's no way back up. Nope, I can go over there. We gotta get this crystal. This crystal base is huge. <laughs> oh, hey, look, another crystal. How do I get there? How do I do it? Like this? There we go. Oh, hey, I could have climbed up. What's over here? Like, what is this little area for climbing? Hmm. Oh, hey, look, an enemy. Did I just kill it with my range? Oh yeah, I have increased damage. All right, now how do I get back up? Looks like I need to go the long way. No! It's so hard to control your jumps. I think I'm back up though. Huh. Huh. Almost fell down again. Up here, that's the way. One hit. One hit. Yeah! Feels good. Hey, look, I can get over there. Not like that. Guess I gotta start from back here. Yeah. yeah. So many crystals that I don't need anymore. What am I going to? No! There's a dead guy. I guess I'm going over here. Yep. The last of the squad. What am I standing on? Feathers. That's some blood. There's so much blood in this area. Making it blue and making it humorous does not make it less disturbing for me. It makes it more disturbing. A tattered note. My apologies to the staff, but their highness has decided they simply must spend another night as a special guest. 
Please follow our standard clandestine protocols. No one must find out about this visit, especially the price tag. Domitius Deluxe, proprietor of Aider's Towers. So I had a thought while warping around, maybe that journal we found about the person who traded planets and, and then found inner peace, maybe that person was Terragon. And then he just traveled around and left journals everywhere. That would make sense. We have found the last squad. Who has been crushed by their own ship. No survivors. Not yet, squad. Your report. Our ship has become wet into Ida's tower of pleasure. By some incredible stroke of good fortune, we seem to have landed at a massive pile of pillows, which cushioned our fall. I think if we all work together, we can use our strength to lift the ship over our heads long enough to unwedge it and fly out of that ship. Looks like an away team. I should let Ames know. Ray to Ames, Ray to Ames. I found Nathia's squad. Just tell me. It seems like they were crushed by their own ship. Curse this bastard void! It is our duty to ensure that their sacrifices were not in vain. All right. Almost got it. Ames, are you there? Uh, thanks to your efforts, I've triangulated the position my away teams were converging on. The signal is coming from under the Senate Pavilion. The first citizen in their wisdom must have built a bunker to keep all Cycladorians safe. Oh. Let's finish this side quest. And I think I want to do it before tackling the remnant. Must lead to the vault that Ames mentioned. So I've been to the vault before, and I think it inserted a new um, chapter on the side quest. Oh, hey, look, you got it open. What are we going to find in here? What horrific nightmare? Lots of treasure and dead people. Ooh, not dead. They're gone. All this useless money. Amy's crew. It looks like some of them managed to survive and made their way here. To where all the money is. At least they've died surrounded by gold. First citizen Pertinax. Why are you in this room filled with greed? My away team. Murdered. Why? For what? It looks like Pertinax had some secrets. I'm sorry, Ames. People aren't always who they say they are. You think I can't see that? You think I'd never heard the rumors? I sent my crew to their graves. They trusted me, and I let them die. It all happened so fast. Pertinax shot them without a shred of guilt, and I unholstered my pistol. I ended the Cycladorian Empire. It's something I can never forget, and yet I'd already seen it in every dream I've had since entering this place. Wait, so you you did that and then you like suppressed the memory? Sometimes people panic when they think they have no other choice. And they do things they regret. No. It's this place. It must have done this to me. To the first citizen. This place corrupts everything. My people all lost to this cursed void. Oh yeah, yeah, it was the no. void that corrupted them. It's this it must have done this to me, to the first citizen. Wait, you're repeating it? I did everything I could for the Empire. I would send a thousand more to their deaths if it meant I could save my kingdom. This is no place to live. You should get out of here if you can. Yes, save the Empire. That's what we must do. Tell Yeoman Roe and Grimclaw to ready the away teams. But they're, they're already dead. 
So I finished that side quest. I'm still worried about this one because there's still a bunch of stuff that I haven't found yet. It said I should go to places I haven't been before, but I just haven't found any mushrooms anywhere else. So um, maybe there's another area that I haven't found out about, but it definitely seems like this is the last area. First citizen Pertinax, shot dead. They protected their lives to the bitter end. <sighs> I guess money is money, wherever you go. <sighs> I, I do... could have been saved if they'd had a leader who cared about their people. I do get why they included this in the game. It's thematically relevant, but they could have done it and not been so over the top about it. Now I get to skate out here. Because like the rest of this game is serious and it feels like it's out of place to have this like, oh yes, we're gonna be the best empire of all time. And we're just gonna go happily to our deaths. Oh, ha, 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 ha. That, that just, that doesn't jive with the rest of the game. And for me, that in my final thoughts, that is going to be a major con. I think they could have done this, had the same effect and just had it be more serious instead of trying to be funny about it. Man, I like having one hit kill. All right, here we are back here. How do we do this? If I hit one of these, it's gonna turn some rails on, right? Not that one. Okay, so I gotta do this one first. Uh, it didn't. And then this one. And then this one. Bam. Now we're good. No. Don't look over there again. Turn the camera around. All right, now we come back here. And we go up here to where the anomaly is. Now, is this gonna take me all the way over there? I think so. You go over here. Last one is gonna be a challenge. Here we are. Where did it go? I'm not going the right way, am I? I didn't see where it went. I thought it would just go around in a circle. Oh, there's two of them. Alright, now it goes this way. Come on. Yeah. Here we are, big remnant. Rust dragger. Oh, it's a belly button eye. Just check to see if there's anything over here. There is. Ha. Huh. Okay, let's fight this remnant. Or do I have to climb that area? That thing? Do I have to go up there? Huh. How far can I go if I do this? Not super far, but far enough to be cool. Hmm. I like how it automatically targets the enemies. Find a way up. I wonder if I get close to it, if I'll be able to grapple onto something. Yep.
right over here. Yeah. Come on, yeah. Man, this one's bigger than all the others. I go this way. No! Wrong button. So close. We are, just keep going. My thumb is slipping off the stick. No! No! Oh no! Can I make it? Yeah! <laughs> Man, it's always creepy when the red just creeps up like that. Okay, I can go here, and I gotta turn around and go this way. No! That was way faster than I thought. Whoa! I just... Something's not right. Okay. Alright. Let's... Oh yeah, we can just get there from here. Wrong button. Ah, oh, damn it! No! <laughs> Aerial assailant. Just kill a bunch of enemies without touching the ground. Nice. I'm too slow. I missed. No. No, I accidentally used my time slow down. All right. Farther than we've ever gone before. Don't rush it. Yeah, one health down. Is that the best you've got? Nope, it's not gonna get any easier from here. All right, let's see what we can get, how we can get back and deal damage number two. Actually, I don't know where I'm trying to get on this time. Over here, I guess. Yeah. Come on. Alright, this is not so bad so far. Rather repetitive. Good repetition. Except for that. Gotcha! Oh. Okay, first try. Alright, this one is gonna be a challenge now. Now how do I get on? Sounds like it's in pain. Yep. Oops. Okay, I saw that. I try to put it down. There we go. Last one. Oh, hey, we're on a rail. I like it. This feels so good. Oh, yeah. I cannot see. Okay, we are no longer on a rail. Go. Oh, that was close. Where's the next one? Where are we going? Where are we? Where are we going? Why? Where? Where? Darn it. Where are you stabbing? Okay. You just did not break that. I cannot get on to you. That's not nice. Move. 
Move, stab somewhere else. Stab right here. Yeah. Here we go again. Gotcha. Where am I going? This way. Now where? Is that the end? No. There's the end. Remnant defeated. Hopefully I didn't just destroy myself. to try, nor the first to torment me. What other choice is there? The starseed is the only shot my world has. No, our world's dead, Ray. <laughs> if only that were true. I know how you fail, Pete. You can't save anyone, not even yourself. <laughs> okay. So it's not the end of the game. Where's that? Where even is that? I don't remember seeing any more doors like that. Disarmed. Actually, I want to see what that is. Okay, just destroy the remnant. So there's some more. Maybe, maybe there aren't. Maybe there are a few more chapters. Maybe I'm not as close to being done as I thought. I thought I was wondering if disarmed might mean um the star seed is nearly operational. More of our memories are also coming online. We are trying to make sense of them. I was thinking disarmed meant get rid of all shields. Someone set the star seed energy capacitors into an overloaded state. Readings indicate void signatures far greater than targeted operating limits. What does that mean? Can we fix it? It doesn't look good, Ray. Activating the star seed now would be highly dangerous. We can no longer predictably collapse the ultra void in order to release our planet from its pull. Our only option is to shut the star seed down entirely. No. We came this far. Say, why would someone do this? Perhaps our memory logs are damaged, but it appears they were attempting to use the star seed to modify the fabric of space time itself. So to speak. Alter space time? Is that possible? Could we reverse time if we activate the star seed now? Theoretically, yes. But the calculations required to. Sid, this may be our only chance to put things back to the way they were. Before the Ultra Void. Before all of this. We have to take it. We know you have the best intentions, but you would risk creating an irreparable schism in our reality. We fear there would be terrible repercussions if performed incorrectly. That's why you're doing the calculations, Sid. Ray, we insist. <laughs> I want it done. That's an order. Very well. 
Beginning starseed attunement protocol. Processing photon amplitude assessment. Assessment complete. Processing temporal condition assessment. Processing temporal conditions. Processing. Sid. No. Don't tell me. Critical systems offline. Terminal calculation loop. Please try again later. Hmm. Calculation loop. So that's a thing in programming where you can have loops where it does something over and over again, but there has to be a condition that it doesn't loop if the condition is met. And so apparently in this, in Sid's calculation, there was an infinite loop, but maybe it means something like a, a time travel loop calculation or something. Uh, I don't know. All right, so that was this chapter. Apparently there's more chapters, at least one more. I don't know where the gate is, so I'm gonna have to look around for it. I'm gonna end this play session. So thank you very much for watching. Tell me what you think about this game in the comments and subscribe for more Solar Ash and other awesome games. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.